Listen up everyone, the Austrian broadcaster Österreichischer Rundfunk, the ORF, they revealed earlier this morning that singer-songwriter Vincent Bueno will represent Austria at the Eurovision 2020 with an up-tempo song called Alive. Alive, which will be released shortly before the song submission deadline in early March, will have personal hashtags as a theme, withdrawing positivity from within tying these hashtags together. He is not an unfamiliar face to a lot of fans of the contest, as he previously tried to represent Austria in 2016 with the song All We Need Is That Love. Now he actually gets to go. Now Bueno, who is of Ilocano heritage from the Philippines and born on December 10th, 1985 in Vienna, Austria, first came to fame in Austria after winning Musical Die Show in early 2008. Bueno beat nine other contestants in the Broadway musical themed contest and earning praise from original cast members of Miss Saigon, Isai Alvarez and Robert Sena along the way. Now, of him being internally selected by ORF to represent Austria at the contest, he told Eurovision.tv, Wow, even thinking about the fact that I am going to participate in the song contest gives me goosebumps. The Eurovision Song Contest is like the Euro Cup for musicians and singers. The huge stage, all those artists doing their absolute best, all the songwriters and producers of Europe gathering in one place to celebrate their work while at the same time stepping into the ring? It is breathtaking and formidable. Let's go Austria! Though born in Austria, Bueno also went to his parents' homeland and tried his hand at a career there, appeared on a variety show several times in 2010, then signing um, in, into Star Records. And Bueno is a multilingual threat with a German language 2008 debut album and a 2018 English language album called Invincible, along with several tag along singles in between. Now, with Bueno Selection, Austria have again changed tack at Eurovision, opting for an artist with up tempo dance numbers after 2019 Panda, who did not make the grand final with the slower ambient experimental entry limits, and 2018's third place Cesar Samson with the soulful Nobody But You. Only time will tell if Buenos Alive is a success or not, but there is no denying Bueno is an experienced performer who is not lacking in confidence. He says, My happiness comes from deep within. It is something that no fame or money in this world could ever give me. I would like to use this energy purposely. It is not clear if Bueno will ride alive himself, but he certainly has the training and experience for it, having mastered four instruments by the time he entered conservatory in Vienna at age 18. And most of Bueno's works are written by him as well. And regardless of results at Eurovision 2020, we know that at least Bueno's approach to the event in Rotterdam will be to treat it like a party and a positive experience. Now, what do you think of Vincent Buenos representing Austria at the Eurovision 2020? Do you think he'll get Austria back to the grand final? Let us know in the comments section below. We would love to hear from you. Thank you for watching and talk to you soon.